Hey, I'm Steve, and I'm reminding you there will be a total solar eclipse that will occur across parts of North America on April 8, 2024. The eclipse will be fully visible, totality, only in a specific path, affecting 13 U.S. states, parts of Mexico, and eastern Canada. If you want to experience the full eclipse, you should make travel arrangements, but I'm going to show you an eclipse simulator can help visualize your options. The simulator is a free online tool that lets you see what the eclipse will look like from any location in the northern hemisphere with various landscapes and a timeline to track the sun and moon's movements. The simulator is credited to Dan McGlon, a retired mathematician and eclipse enthusiast who built it based on centuries old astronomical knowledge and modern data. Even ancient civilizations like the Babylonians were able to predict eclipses using the sorrow cycle, a recurring pattern they observed. Dan McGlon used various data sources including astronomical records and NASA's Lunar Reconnaissance Orbiter data to create the accurate simulation. In short, a total solar eclipse is coming and a cool online tool lets you see it from anywhere. Hey folks, I am Steve and what you're looking at here is the web page for this cool little solar eclipse simulator. The eclipse is going to be in April 8, 2024. It's not too far away, but you can see this map of the United States and you can see the path that the total solar eclipse is going to take. So just kind of a ride across Arkansas and Indiana, Ohio and New York. It's just a pretty wide path. I saw the last eclipse. I had to travel to South Carolina to see it and one of the most amazing natural phenomenons I have ever seen in my life. So if you are anywhere where you could take advantage and go see this for yourself, you definitely should. All right, if you look up here to the right, you see City Search. So what I'm going to do is I'm just going to pick out a place across that map. Let's just, it's going to cross Arkansas. Let's type in Little Rock, Arkansas. All right, so you get this pop up right here and it says click here to see the Little Rock City page or launch the Eclipse Simulator. So I'm going to launch the simulator for Little Rock. I'm going to click I agree and now it's going to open up and give us a whole new page for the simulator and this is based on if you were in Little Rock and of course you can type in whatever city you want but you can see the sun up here and they give you some little explanations down here you have a time slider a fine time slider and it's pointing arrows to whatever uh, is the slide the correct sliders and animation and zoom so what you can do I'm just going to X out of that right here and you've got the Sun here and it's going to give you some values so if I take some of these sliders and move them around I can determine where and when the Eclipse occurs so if you look down at the bottom right it's going to give you your time stamp so at 1243 in Little Rock here's the eclipse just starting it's just beginning and I've got my mouse holding it and I'm just going to pull it across you can see the eclipse more and more and more at 134 that's what it's going to look like in Little Rock I'm going to keep pulling that slider to the right and around 150. There you go, 150 and 151, you are going to experience the total solar eclipse. Now, I have seen this in real life. It is unbelievable. You just couldn't believe what this actually looks like if you haven't seen one in person. So I'm going to keep moving it and now we're going to start coming out 
we're coming out we're coming out we're coming out I'm sliding it and now at about 312 or so in Little Rock the solar eclipse is over all right y'all that is it check out the simulator like I said I will put links in the description to get you here and you can type in whatever city that you're in or would like to travel to I highly recommend it it'll be a it's actually a bucket list type event absolutely so if you go come back and let me know how it was all right y'all I'll see you next time